Am I the arsehole? For asking my sill to pay me for the cost of hair and skin oils she threw out. I and my husband Alex have allowed my sill Julie to stay in our house due to her STBX kicking her out after filing for divorce. Julie still has her job, but doesn't want to go through the ordeal of getting a new apartment while dealing with her STBX, and we didn't want her to have to stay in the hotel during that. I'm Indian, and Alex and the rest of his family are white, I feel like that may be relevant to what happened here. I use oils for most of my hair and skin care, I also use chemically manufactured products, but I found that it's better for my hair and skin. That's also how my mother cared for me when I was younger. Julie disapproves of this and thinks that I'm just going around town an oily and greasy mess, despite me repeatedly explaining why I do this to her. She's tried to convince me to switch to all chemical products she uses, but I politely decline each time. When I woke up today after sleeping in with Alex, I walked into our shared bathroom and saw the case of my oils was not there. I looked further around the bathroom to see where it could be and asked my husband if he had moved it. Alex said no, and that's when I went into the living room and asked Julie about the case. Julie gave me a smirk and told me that she had woken up early this morning and took my case out of the bathroom to drive to the other side of the community we live in and dump it into the garbage bin there. I was tired and thought she was joking until Julie bragged about it, saying that she did me a favor and that I wouldn't have to use such uncivilized ways of taking care of myself. X200B once her words sunk in, I was pissed and called Alex into the room to explain to him what she did. Alex seemed disappointed, but not surprised about what Julie did and told her what she did was disrespectful. Julie tried to defend herself, saying that she only did what she thought was best, and it shouldn't be such a big deal. I cut her off, saying that I wanted her to give me $76 which was the cost of the oils so I could replace them. Julie got nervous and said she was in a tight spot financially so she couldn't pay me back right away. I said that was fine, but I expected her to pay me at some point. After a small back and forth Julie eventually packed a bag and said she'd be staying in a hotel to give me time to cool down and realize how irrational I was being. A few hours later, my Mill and Phil scolded me for making Julie uncomfortable in my home and that I shouldn't force her to pay for something so small. My husband asked his mom how she'd feel if Julie tossed out the hundreds of dollars of skincare she owned because Julie thought it wasn't good for her. X200B My Mill just replied with that's different. Before telling us that I should apologize and then hanging up. Edit my mill and fill are paying for Julie's hotel and apparently are going to do so until she comes back to our house. Fuck your mill, fill and double fuck that sill. I tell Alex I want her out. That's such a crossing of obvious boundaries, you don't know what's coming next. Not the asshole. Two points how can Julie afford a hotel but not the $76 replacement cost? It's different because it's Mills not yours, rolling eyes face. Not the asshole. Sounds like Julie's parents are getting a new roommate. Not the asshole. She stole from you. Ban her from your house. Not the asshole and let her remain in the hotel. She doesn't get to come back to your home until she repays you. She clearly has money if she's staying in a hotel. A guest in your home stole your belongings, threw them away, gaslighted you, and then drummed up support from your in-laws. Not the asshole. Don't apologize. Not the asshole obviously. House guests shouldn't get in the habit of disposing of their host's possession. They should just thank them instead. But I don't understand. She can't pay you $76 but she can just grab a hotel room no problem. Not the asshole that's different? How? Because mill products are white products? That's all that comes to my mind. Not the asshole. Your stuff is your stuff and she needs to keep her opinions to herself. Not the asshole. That's biting the hand that feeds you even if the oils were bad for you. They're sure as hell not though. 
Nine times out of ten if you look at the ingredients of hair and skin care products they include many such oils anyway. Not the asshole. Please don't compromise in this. If you do, they will do it forever. They should be careful next time they mess with you. And you got a nice husband who stands up for you. Not the asshole and I would not allow her back into your home as she could destroy more of your possessions. Julie is a huge a hole and very wasteful throwing away those products, if she won't pay you back then go to small claims court to get the money back from her, because I doubt she'll do it willingly. Not the asshole. Also don't let her back into your house on the basis that she's an ungrateful guest that can't be trusted because what she did was theft. If your mill feels so strongly about it she can house her instead. Not the asshole. Sorry you married into a racist family. Natar, and tell Sil enjoy the hotel because you are never setting a foot back in my home. You need to pay me back and apologize and then maybe I'll let you be in my life, if not goodbye. Not the asshole. So Julie can afford to stay in a hotel but can't afford $76 worth of products. You're good not the asshole. Happy to see your partners advocating too. But honestly let her go stay with Mill. Not the asshole she can afford a hotel room but she can't afford to replace your stuff that she threw away. From your in-laws reaction, it's pretty obvious how Julie turned out this way. Not the asshole. And I hope you don't let her back into your home. STBX soon to be X. Not the asshole. Julie made herself uncomfortable in your home through her disrespectful behavior. Let her stay in a hotel, or with your mill and fill. You don't need that shit. So, Julie has the money for a hotel room, but not enough to replace the oils. Not the asshole has Julie been put on a pedestal her entire life? This behavior from her is not cool yet her family seems fine with it. File a police report for theft and then take her to small claims court. Not the asshole, she doesn't have money to replace your stuff but she has money for hotel? Yeah I can guess why Bill kicked her out. Very simple she's not coming back to your house. I am not quick to drop heavy works, but what she did was racist. This is a hill to die on. Not the asshole. Not the asshole have them pay for it forever and never allow Sil back. The $76 will seem like a bargain at that point. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. And please tell me she is not coming back to your house. Not the asshole. Until she comes back to our house. I hope your in laws can afford to pay till hell freezes over because that's when she would be allowed back in my home for any reason, let alone to live. She has the money for a hotel but not to pay you for the products she dumped. If she can afford a hotel she can afford to pay you back. Not the asshole. My Mill and Phil are paying for Julie's hotel and apparently are going to do so until she comes back to our house. Well, problem solved. No, really though, give her proper notice and get her out of there.